interested. Catherine Morgan Ballet Bar. Uh, I did the beginner one because I was trying, I'm trying to get back into it, like class type instead of me giving myself class. And that was way harder than a beginner class, I'm just gonna say. But it was very good. It was exactly what I needed as far as strengthening and all of that stuff. Um, it was beginner in the sense of like combinations were very simple to pick up. But um, I was looking in the mirror today. Um, I haven't been in tights and leotard in a little bit. And I was looking at my legs and I noticed that I, and this is not a weight chain thing, but I just noticed that my legs were a lot skinnier. Um, I used to have a little bit more bulk in my thighs. Um, my, my thighs would be able to touch in first. Um, and they would have a slight curvature because I have a bit of a round, like a round shape like this in my thighs and it's very slight so it does cause air to peek through. Um, and it's not in my knees, it's actually in my upper thigh. So I was just noticing, I was like, oh, I've had a lot of muscle loss. Um, and then the other day I was actually playing um, with this puppy, my friend's puppy, and was laying on the floor and I was like getting up a lot and using my arms and I realized, and I noticed that my arms were really, really sore, my pecs were really sore. And so it's a little bit discouraging in the sense that I feel a lot weaker than I used to be. And I mean, I still have the flexibility, I still have the technique, I still have the ability to do everything that I could do before. I just feel weaker doing it. It's not even like, oh, my muscles are weak or my stamina is weak. It's just, I feel weak. I don't feel strong when I do it. I don't feel like my dancing feels very strong. Um, it feels very weak. Uh, and I'm not too sure that it looks super, super as weak as I feel. <laughs> um, Cause as a dancer, you tend to not look as bad or as good as you feel. <laughs> so I'm taking my vitamins. Xanthan for cardio and visual vitality. Um, I it is also an anti-aging. It is also an anti-aging formula. Um, and basically, what happens when you have an eating disorder is that your body starts to wear down. You know, like as if you were an old person. So I am 20 years old. I have a lot of gray hair, and I'm starting to get wrinkles in. Um, my body, when I say that my body is not what it used to be, that's exactly how I feel. And not many 20 year olds uh, my age, even dancers that are 20 year olds are saying that. Yeah, we have aches and pains here and there, but not nearly as bad. So I'm doing my best to take care of my body. I actually ate a really good meal today. So I'm very proud of myself. I had a call with my, uh, my health coach yesterday very good. Um, we're talking a lot right now about how emotions affect our eating habits and things like that. So it's been very, very good for me. 
and yeah I've just been trying to take better care of my body and <laughs> hasn't always been easy but I know that it will get better. Use the first set to really find this, okay? So yeah, um, this was the first class. I'm trying to dance at least three times a week. It's really, really hard for me to do that, but I need to. Um, it's really important for me and my body, and I need to get more disciplined. It's a lot harder to be disciplined when you don't have somebody forcing you to do it. leotard today because it's always been a leotard that feels really slimming on me and I feel really elegant in it. Um, it's got a low back but at the front it just it's perfect. It makes me feel a little bit more open and better about <laughs> the shape of my body right now. Not to say that I think I'm fat or by any means but again I don't have that muscle that I used to have and that strength that my body look like it carried and I don't feel like I have that right now. So that is a little bit of an insecurity for me right now. Uh, just real talk. I mean, um, when you're dancing almost like six to eight hours every day, yeah, you're gonna build some muscle tone and you're gonna look like you're freaking strong. And for me, I never look like the strongest of the bunch, but I got to a space where I did love my body for um, how it felt how strong I felt, how strong I felt like I looked. And um, yeah, I thought my you know body is, was beautiful. And so I'm trying to get back to that. Not saying my body isn't beautiful now, but I am a little bit more self-conscious about my body right now. So, um, and not in the sense that I feel like I'm fat, but <laughs> in the sense of um, like, it's not where I want it to be. It's okay, but it's not where I want it to be or not feeling nauseous. Um, there's some days, don't get me wrong, there are some days when I'm under high stress and that's what it feels like. But for the most part, it hasn't been too bad. So I'd say we're at a good pace. And now I'm going to stretch and I'm super sweaty.